What's up, y'all? Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into um, Cardi B going off on everybody because somebody called CPS on her offset. Let's get it. Taking shit too far. When you mess with my f I swear to you, I'm going to get to the f bottom, bottom of it, okay? For you motherfuckers to do a little f prank call what is the CPS protective services? For protective services to come to my house, not my house, my gated mansion at 11 p.m. while my children are sleeping because there's an anonymous call children. that there's been going on that, that my kids have been getting abused. Are you fucking dumb? Are you fucking dumb? This is when the pranks start getting too far. When you mother. Oh, when you ask, think the shit is funny. And it's not funny. It's not funny. First of all, me, I'm the only person, and I'm the only person that is Latin, that is black people in my house. Uh, that it's in the whole neighborhood, I mean. I'm sorry, I'm the. We are the only people in my neighborhood completely. And for motherfuckers to pop up in my house with cops and protective services because you motherfuckers want to do an anonymous call involving my children? I ain't gonna lie, that's crazy. I w she has every right to be upset. I don't know why people play so much. I, I promise you this. At one point in time, uh... Little people was off. I'm going to start calling them little people. Little people was off limits. Little people and women. What happened? I promise you this. I promise you this. I'm going to sue your protective services for coming to my house at whatever the time it comes. And I'm also going to sue the, per the person that did this anonymous call. And, I'm, and as soon as I wake up in the morning... I'm calling Drew Finling because I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm going to hire the best private investigator in the whole country because y'all take joking and y'all take shit a little too far. Don't you ever in your life play with my Don't you ever Can she sue child protective? In your life play with my motherhood or with my ex-husband fatherhood. We don't play that shit. My kids live great. If CPS deprives you of your civil rights, you may be able to sue the caseworker or the agency itself in federal court. Hmm. Deprives your civil rights. Showing up to your house at 11 o'clock at night might be depriving your civil rights. My never been touched. Never got hit. No matter how annoying they are, I never hit my... Every weekend, my kids go to Fly Zone or to the American Dream Mall or shopping or to eat. Um, what my daughter likes to eat, she likes to eat ramen, whatever. Ramen. My kids are super spoiled. They go to the best school. My daughter, um, school tuition fees is forty-five thousand. Wave is thirty-five thousand. My newborn baby, her nanny is seven hundred dollars an hour uh, a day. Seven hundred dollars a day. Damn. We take very great care of our kids. I spend more money on my kids' bill than I spend money on clothes for myself. And when I, because, oh, yeah, protective services, supposedly they're going to come in the morning. And I cannot wait because my mom is going to curse them out the nasty way. The fucking nasty way. The fucking nasty way. You could play with me, but you can't play with that woman. My mom's going to curse you out. And I swear to God, I'm going to teach motherfuckers a lesson. First, y'all was sending pizzas to my house. Now y'all sending protective services. And I promise you, I'm going to call Drew Filling in the morning. I'm going to call a private investigator. I'm going to hire a private investigator. And I'm going to get my aunt's husband, which is a private investigator, to work on who is it. Because if protective service don't give me this anonymous person i'm gonna find out myself
Can they give out the anonymous? Can, <clears throat> Can CPS give out the anonymous? I'm spelling it wrong. Um, uh, first. It is confidential by law and they will not release it. Cardi B. We can't be breaking the law, friend. <laughs> I mean, I get why she upset, but Cardi. Uh. And you know what? You want to know what I'm going to do? I'm not even pressing charges on you. If you a boy, my baby father is going to beat you the f*** up. If you a woman, me and Hennessy are going to beat you the f*** up. Because you playing with my mother. Stop playing with my mother. Not everything is a fucking joke. Not everything is a fucking prank. That's why I got two securities in my house. One in the front, one in the back. We're fucking loaded up rifles. Just because I know y'all- Shout out to Nine Mag for editing out all these words. Like to play when you have bitches address. But I promise you, I'm going to find out who the fuck you are. And you're going to be on, on your knees. Begging me for fucking mercy for the fucking prank that you decided to do. Don't bring that shit in my home. I just realized this was on my head. It's a wrap. Home. <laughs> Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm the only person of that lives in my motherfucking neighborhood. And y'all bringing this shit, y'all bringing cops, mad cop cars, and protect the ser services to my fucking gate. Are you dumb? You know how great my kid's life is? You know how well behaved my children are? Stop playing. The street's gonna handle it. No, I'm gonna take matters to my hand. Y'all want a prank call? Y'all want to do funny shit? Y'all want to give anonymous tips and involve my kids in it? Now you're gonna you're gonna see you're gonna see the evil side of me because I'm not letting that shit fucking go. Oh, Y'all going to I'm going to I'm going to beat the shit out of you. I'm not calling the cops on you. As soon as I know and retract that phone call, I'm going to beat the shit out of you. If you're Man, my baby father is gonna beat the shit out of you because you thought it was okay to mess with our. Stop playing. Party, why are we in the hospital? What's going on? And you know how many people helped me raise my kids? Huh? Know how spoiled my kids are? Know how innocent my kids are? Sometimes me and, and, and my baby daddy joke around like it's like, damn, we give our kids so much that we wonder sometimes, are they gonna be ready for the real world? Because we protect them so much. We protect them so much. I see the difference with cultures, Cousins that live in the hood and with culture. She's so innocent because she goes to school with like a whole bunch of Asians and white people. And a school that like, they literally hold your hand and protect you. And you motherfuckers even have the fucking nerve to fucking play games with my kids. First offset, I don't know where he at. I don't know where he at, but I had to call him because of this shit. Tight. Why the f is people in my house with nah, mad cop real. cars for my anonymous call that my kids are being a? And it sounds like none of the, neither one of them are there. What my kids are sleeping? All three of them. And my house is so fun, so amazing. Every kid that comes to my house, they don't ever want to leave. They don't want to leave at all. Shit done me off. 
And yes, guys, I'm very sick. I've been here since today's date. I've been here since the 19th. I'm extremely sick. I hope I hope I get to leave tomorrow, but I know I'm not. But anyways, I just want you to know, you, you, whoever you are, Jean, the, that's it. <laughs> decided to prank call and send protective services to my house. I'm, I got money. I got real fucking money. And I'm going to find you. I'm going to hire a lawyer and I'm going to hire two PIs. If I don't find you, I'm suing protective services for even having the mother. Couldn't even let you finish. All right. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I hope uh, she figured it out, girl. Or not. You're going to hurt somebody. All right. Love y'all. Bye.